that um, I present in Aurora for at every single meeting that I start with a top-down view, which I think is very impactful of identifying where they are. And in my role, I'm both in person half of the time and remote through Zoom like this with screen sharing the other half. Um, so being able to verify where we are specifically, get the client buy-in, and then once they're on board with that, render it all in three dimensions. And I would say two thirds of the time, people are like, oh, wow, like this is awesome. They'll say that literally at that point. I mean, if they don't trust you, they're not gonna sign up for a 25 plus year arrangement for this project. So it's the front end and it goes a long way beyond that. But building that trust is so important and having a tool that I wouldn't call it flashy, but it's kind of bordering on flashy in a good way. It captures people's attention and they're not necessarily used to it. That they might have had someone in the home drawing like squares and just drawing the quote on the board, but I'm putting as much emphasis on the design as the financial details, which I won't even touch on until we've they're bought in on the design that we're discussing. I think it definitely does that I think it is, in my opinion, the premier design tool. I'm not aware of a better one. Uh, I ranked it initially 10 out of 10 because I believe that. I don't go around ranking things that I don't want to support, but I think it helps. We probably could have any software, and I'm not the one making that level of decisions, but management really likes it as well. The auto design tool is pretty excellent, um, and I, I haven't used a lot of other softwares, but it's above and beyond the best one that I've used in my six-year career.